the whole principle of hydroponic is uh, the reason why you can grow plants in water the detergents uh, give the plants the food that they normally draw from the soil so a proper hydroponic system you need to feed all the time if uh, it's an industrial type farming arrangement they put uh, the nutrients into the water in an artificial way here because the water is already great the nutrient is in, uh, in the water and uh, the plants get the food without you having to make too much effort win-win so the water uh, it initially um, flows from all the from the showers, baths, washing machine, it flows to a collection tank that is underneath the house and the pump pumps it to the bottom, of, to, sorry, to the top of the house and then from there it just comes down with the hydroponics and it cleans, it circulates like that. When you uh, flush the toilet in the house, it draws the water from this system. So instead of using uh, fresh water, municipal water for the toilet, you use water that's recycled. The pond system is, yes, it takes the overflow. So if we have too much grey water in the system, it goes and feeds the pond. There, there's nice plants and nice animals and everything. And uh, in the pond, it normally whatever uh, surplus is uh, either evaporates from the pond or flows to the rest of the garden. Here we have a black water recycle system. We also treat the water that we flush from the toilet, and there. There's very little that you actually need to draw from the municipal water system. It works in the long run not to return any water to the sewer system, rather to keep all the water for yourself. That means the water that you have to add is very little. The trick is when you're out of the house to drink a lot, then when you come into the house, you use the toilet a lot. This way you actually create <laughs> more water than what you use. <laughs>